Hey everyone. In this video, we're gonna say detail about virtual private networking. A virtual private network or a VPN is an encrypted connection over the internet from your remote network to your main office network. So VPN allows computer or a whole network to connect to each other over the internet securely. So if you have your branch office in India and main office in Dubai, so VPN allows you to connect securely from India to Dubai securely over the internet. Now we will see why we got the need of VPN. Let's say you are transferring data from your remote office India to main office in Dubai over the internet which is unsecure network. So the hacker can attack your data and can decrypt the data. This make the unsecure communication because we were transferring data over the public network and might have chances of loss of data. In this VPN will provide secure communication over the public network. Now we are going to see in detail working of VPN. VPN will encrypt the data from the sender to recipient by the help of VPN tunnel and the tunneling protocol which is utilized to encrypt the data. To help ensure confidentiality of data as it travel over the shared or public network, it is encrypted by the sender and decrypted by the receiver. Because data encryption is performed by the VPN client and the VPN server. So it is necessary to use data encryption on the communication link. There are two tunneling protocol which is mainly utilized in VPN that is point to point tunneling protocol that is PPTP and layer 2 tunneling protocol which is L2TP. A single VPN tunnel has speed of 3 Gbps. With VPN you can connect or you can log into corporate network while traveling or working from home or just from your mobile device. You just need to enter your username and password on the VPN client and after authentication you will get connected to your corporate network. Another advantage of VPN is that let's say a website is blocked in India and the same website is allowed to access in Dubai. Now you will get connected to VPN and you can access that website. For example, let's say Facebook is not allowed to access in India but it is allowed to access in Dubai region. So when you get connected to VPN, you will get connected to that Dubai network so that you can access all the website that is being allowed in this Dubai network. The condition for this VPN is that you need to have the same company's VPN client and the same company's VPN server. Let's say you have, let's say you are using your VPN client of Cisco, then you need to have Cisco VPN server. Or you are using Microsoft VPN client, then you need to have Microsoft VPN gateway. The both the VPN client and the VPN gateway need to be of same company. Now we are going to see the types of VPN. There are two types of VPN, side to side VPN and remote access VPN. A side to side VPN is used where there is a need to connecting an entire network in one location to a network in another. This is usually a small branch connecting to a data center. Site to site VPN connection is a network to a network connection or a server to a server connection. Next is remote access VPN. In remote access VPN, the user can connect to corporate network with the help of VPN client. The VPN client can be installed and can be used on laptop, tablet or smartphones. So a remote access VPN is a connection from your VPN client that is from computer to a network or from a smartphone to a network. The user just need to enter their username and password and they will get connected to corporate network. If you have any questions or suggestion, please do let me know in the comment section. And finally, 